Police say the victims were gathered around a vehicle when the shots were fired, leaving two sisters dead. The women identified as 27-year-old Stephanie Talusme and 23-year-old Joanna Talusme. Family members say the 27-year-old was visiting friends with her younger sister Joanna in Northwest Miami Dade when they were gunned down and left to die in a parking lot. The people who's doing the most damage to black folks are black folks. So we need to stand up and stop each other from doing this kind of stuff. Was it what did they say? He was 24 years old. Jeez Louise, they think I had a hard life. He had a hard night life for him. He had a hard night life for him. Look in his lips. He smoked crack. Why you take a photo like that? He had a hard night life for him. He had a hard night life for him. Look in his lips. He smoked crack. Why you take a photo like that? Hard night life. Two of them were eventually let go, but one of them, 23-year-old Malik Cox, was arrested for possession of marijuana. You mean possession of crack? Shazam! Look at the face on this nigga. This nigga look like Master P when, when he didn't get no, he didn't get paid. He had to hook up. He wasn't the ice cream man. He was the ice cream liquor. What is wrong with this man? Right after Nipsey Hussle, I'm pretty sure these girls probably posted something about how mad or sad or messed up it was about Nipsey Hussle. And within a week, they're dead themselves. This is sad. This is sad for the black community. And if you want to be mad at somebody, don't be mad at me for what I report. Don't get mad at anybody else but the violent offenders. That's who we should be upset with right now. Why is it that people like myself are called coons and sellouts, but the killers and the thugs are not called coons and sellouts? No matter how many black people they kill, they will still tell you that I'm worse than them. That I cause the black community more damage by my YouTube videos than they actually do with the violence that they are out here perpetrating on each other. Guys, we gotta stand up and take a stance, and that stance should say, if you are black and you are taking a black life, if you are black and you are calling violence amongst blacks, then you should be considered the sellout. You should be considered the race traitor. Because you cannot have any unity when you're constantly going to funerals that are being caused by the blacks. Now I'm out. It's a hard knock life.